uploading. I don't think so. I don't think it can wait that long. When I started vlogging, I called my aunt and uncle Wildflower and Goofy Guru in their home. This may be a lost cause. I don't know when this is gonna upload. Oh. I'm I'm wondering if I should surprise them, scare them. We could have some fun. Sandwich. Well, I, have, I was under the impression that uh, patients rode these things all the time like you do. You know, you I've know, only driven a couple of times. She likes it. She likes it. She likes, she likes it. to ride See, that, that, that. That's like you now. Know, it's like this. Question. Listen, <laughs> a real woman can drive a go kart, but a real man won't let her because. <laughs> <laughs> you know what that comes from. Oh. Really, Glenn, that was clever. <clears throat> we had a race with bad guys in this. But this is my hot rod, you know. What can I say? Oh, that's right. You guys you were here. We've had it two years now. Paid four hundred bucks for it. Wow. You're in gear. You can start it in gear. You ready? Enough gas to keep oh, you it running. Keep that? Since Padre, since since you're worried about your bottle being mixed up, I wrote on it with nail polish for you. Oh, you wrote with nail polish or something? Not exactly. She said they're out here. I wrote his, not yours. His on the other side says not yours. His, not yours. Well, it'd be easy for me to spot that way. Thank you. Very nice. I might want to keep that bottle and take it home, even when I'm done with drinking this water. So I can keep it at home. And you'll know that it's his and not yours. <laughs> yeah. Because uh, if it's his and not yours, that indicates, you know, obviously that it's, it's obviously his. You shouldn't be drinking it. So there you have it. What if another guy drinks it, then you'd be confused. Well, he'll be very confused because he obviously knows that it's, you know, and it is and it's his and it's not yours. And it's not his. Because <laughs> if it's not yours, it's obviously not his. People tell us they've seen him. Oh. <laughs> it's like a music park ride. <laughs> yeah. I think I'm sitting on this thing. It might put me up too high, so I don't have to. Look, there's adjustment here. No, and look, here. his is different. No. The long and winding creek. Boom, boom. <laughs> there's 
more fish. Look at them fish. Look at them fish. I was thinking I could put mom in the front seat of one of these and take it down. What do you think? Yeah. How'd you run them over? <laughs> Get ready, get ready to limbo rock! Are you ready? Hello, can you wait? All you limbo boys and girls, all around the limbo. Where are we going? Where are we going? Where are we going? Boom, boom. <laughs> we found a sweet. There was this guy here the last time we were here. He was, I don't know which he was he living. Was. He was way up there. Like 40 foot at least in the air. Maybe higher. You jumped off? Yeah. Times. He said, if I hadn't had a couple drinks, I'd have never done that. Hold it, Allie's going to film you jumping out. Be careful, Samuel. I think that's where it's tied. I think the other end is where you got loose. <laughs> yeah, and if you straddle out there, he might not hold you. Shimmy out on that branch and get that rope. Are you kidding? <laughs> that branch will definitely go. <laughs> hmm. You might should not listen to Glenn. Don't worry. If the branch falls, you'll land in the water. <laughs> well, I just see sit when he hits the water Indian style, but I would think that would sting like, don't that sting your legs a little bit hitting the water like that? No. I want to try. No. Hey, just send me. No, do it. Jumping or getting the rope? No. Get the rope. Oh, okay, you can go get the rope. Your dad says it's okay. Sam, just scoot up and do it. You guys, look at Sam. There you go. Sam, we're going to swim up there. If we can get in the water. Don't panic! Don't panic! He's coming over to see you. Come on! Wait, give me back! Oh, I can touch here. Where's the other one go? Over there. There he is, right on that. Oh, he's the biggest one yet. Inside of it, like down there. <laughs> Hopefully, we won't crash. What's your seat on there? What? Oh! <laughs> I guess I'll just <laughs> hang on. is flooded. So, uh, and I babysit the girls in the morning. <laughs> Nine in the morning, and that's the way to their house. I may be swimming there. <laughs> so, we're, our pool's probably over 
glowing. So, my cat, she just loves what Mother Nature has done with our street. Want to go swimming? Yeah, I'll give you a push. No? Oh. It almost flooded right in front of our house. But see, it's dry just right there. I don't know about you. What is that buzzer thing coming from right there? And over there. Well, like I said, I don't know about you, but what is that? Any bug experts out there? I want to know what that is. But, uh, I'm hoping, I'm trying to talk shh, that, you know, some of this evaporates, you know, by tomorrow morning. That is just rude. Okay. All this water's attracting those biting bugs and mosquitoes and ants. I'm getting bit. You want to stay out here, Amy? I'll leave you out here. You can't even go anywhere. You can't leave the yard. Okay. Bye. <laughs>